welcome. Today we're going to be taking a look at the ABSO line of battery chargers from Kisei Technology. Kisei makes battery chargers designed for both AC and DC inputs, as well as 12 and 24 volt systems. Today we're going to be taking a look at these DC powered units designed for 12 volt systems. You may be new to the concept of a DC powered battery charger, so let me explain some of the thoughts behind these units from Kisei. Unlike a traditional AC powered battery charger which pulls power from the power grid, these take power from a DC input source, one of two. We can actually power them by the alternator which charges the starting battery, or we can actually use power from a solar array as well. The charger then takes this DC input and creates a smart charging algorithm, much like you would with any smart charger, to charge your house battery in a smart method. This might be really useful in a boat when you're away from the dock, or if you're boondocking in your RV and you're not anywhere near somewhere you can plug into shore power. Kisei DC to DC battery chargers come in two size ratings. One is a 30 amp and one is a 50 amp. If you have a battery bank that's up to 150 amp hours, then use the 30 amp. If you have a battery bank that's up to 250 amp hours, then use the 50 amp. Kisei DC to DC chargers take their power from either the alternator, which is connected to the starting battery, or from a solar array. The default power sources can be changed depending on whether the optional ignition override is connected to the charger. Both the 30 and the 50 amp version of the Kisei DC to DC chargers feature an integrated MPPT solar charge controller. This eliminates the need for an own standalone solar controller for your solar array. You simply connect the panels directly to the unit. The controller is rated for solar arrays up to 500 watts and operate between 14 and and 45 volts. When the vehicle's engine is running, the Kisei DC to DC chargers will sense the power coming from the alternator. At this point, they will use the power stored in the starting battery to charge the house battery while the alternator charges the starting battery. Now that we understand how these chargers get their power from DC sources, let's take a look at their charging capabilities. Like their AC powered siblings, the DC to DC chargers deliver a smart charging algorithm consisting of three primary charge stages, bulk, absorption, and flow. This results in a battery that is ready to use faster and improves battery life. The initial bulk charge stage delivers the full rated output current of the charger up to the battery's absorption voltage. Essentially, this charges the battery rapidly to approximately 80% of its capacity. The charger will automatically switch into the absorption mode, which gradually replenishes the remaining 20% of the battery capacity, with the charger current dropping off as the battery approaches a full charge. Once the battery is fully charged, the ABSO charger goes into a float stage, which drops the voltage to a constant level. This phase makes up for any parasitic loads on the battery or self-discharge. Like all of Kisei's ABSO battery chargers, the DC to DC chargers have charging algorithms designed for flooded, AGM, gel, and lithium batteries. They also have a unique program mode which allows you to program all the chargers functions for any future battery technologies.